my name is Colma Briscoe. I'm a graduate of UCD. I graduated in 1980 with a BA degree in music and Irish. Irish is very close to my heart as we spoke Irish at home. I also went to two Irish speaking schools, Golokha and Golosh Eastman. Anybody can play a chord. You don't have to know what a chord is or how to play it. If you want to play a chord, you have to play more than three notes at a time. And that is a chord. But to know what it is, a major, a minor, diminished, augmented chord, an inverted chord, you'd have to have some theoretical background. Classes in theory and harmony. When I was studying here at UCD, we spent a lot of time studying harmony. What is harmony? A succession of chords. Chords are a combination of sounds as opposed to succession of notes which make up a melody. This is a chord. This is a chord. Take this piece for example by Mihem Esposito. Now, later on, 
he writes the melody in octaves in the right hand. virtuosity, you know? Again, strengthening the melody, giving this sort of bravura feeling. We go on then, and it's not just classical or romantic pieces. Take, for example, Impressionist music. I studied in Paris myself. I studied a lot of music by Claude Debussy. This is the opening of one of his preludes. And it goes like this. has a very simple melody from a piece called La Fille Chez Baudelin, the girl with the flaxen hair. It goes like this. And he continues with the melody. 
different dynamics. that has nothing else but chords. and you look up the word chord, you get several pages and descriptions of the word chord. Whereas for other 
words. You only, might only get one or two words of explanation. I hope I've given you some idea of chordal playing on the piano.